Hello, everybody. This is Chardonnay here. Um, it is 2011. Oh! Okay, I just wanted to say that. So now I've said that, let's move on. Today, I'm going to be talking about this hair on my head right about now. And also, I'm just going to say briefly, um, I did a video of my mum. Basically, we washed her hair and I tried to film it. You know, her hair's just it's too crazy. It's just so much hair. So I didn't film the washing the hair bit, but... I basically sat down and twisted the whole thing in extensions and then we boiled it and all the rest of it. So I just need to edit that video together and all the rest of it because I used my phone, then I used the camera, then I used another phone and it's just ridiculous. So so um, don't forget to look out for that. But anyway, so back to this video. <clears throat> this hair that I'm wearing here, this is a human hair wig, about 14, 16 inch kind of thing. Um, so yeah, so this is the box here anyway. Um, it's by Sleek. I don't know if they sell sleek in America, I don't know, but they sell it out here in the UK. And um, the hair, the wig is called, or I should say she is called Superb. Um, I guess you can see this, uh, there we go. And that's what it looks like. Um, when I first got it, it actually did look like that. But as you can see, that model's got a much slimmer face than I have. So when I first put this wig on, I found that, you know, the fringe was just about letting my eyes be seen. It was so embarrassing right? because I actually bought it and I thought, well, let me just put it on my head and go out. But it wasn't happening like that. So um, I had to ask my friend's uh, sister to try to fix that for me. What was good about the fringe, though, is the fact that the fringe was very long. Um, she's cut, obviously, the fringe here. But as you can see, this was the length of the fringe before. So they do give you a, little, a lot of scope if you want to sweep it or whatever you want to do. But um, I just had to get it thinned out a little bit. It's, it's quite, a, you know, it's a good... A good thickness it doesn't look too overpowering it's got too much hair on it um it also has a a, <clears throat> a, a part in the top and it's a dark skin part in, so i didn't have to put any um pencil or anything on my scalp or anything like that um what i'm finding and that's just because i think this is because because of my my allergies and the rest of it i can't use certain hair polishes and stuff like that my eczema is just not going to have it so I can't use polish and sheens and stuff like that. So I have to keep my wig in the box or on the mannequin heads and stuff like that. Um, but I'm finding that the back is getting a bit, it's getting a bit knotted up. I don't wear this wig very often, but I'm still finding it's getting a bit knotted. Oh no, it's not too bad. It's not too bad. And to be honest, it looks really good. I mean, the texture of it is really, really good. It's a really, really nice texture. I do like that about it. Um, I don't remember how much it cost. I don't remember how much it cost me, actually. Um, it was about... 60 quid or something or 60 pounds i think it was about that something like that anyway um has combs at the side comb at the back and also you can tighten as well so it's exciting for me um i've got my hair underneath and it's just sitting down doing what it needs to do my hair grew back after my trim and i've cut it back again and now it's just even thicker i even colored it i don't know why i didn't document that though um i might i don't know i'm gonna have to color it again because my roots are growing out so i'm gonna i like them kind of it's kind of browns in the front um anyway that's an another video um so yeah my name is chardonnay this is my little sleek wig it's the it's um called superb and it's in 1b it looks quite dark but um well here it looks like 1b i don't know it looks really dark in this i don't know why it looks so dark here but um thank you very much for watching and don't forget to stay tuned for that that video that i'm gonna start editing once i finish this video um and that's of me basically well you see the progress of my mom said since the video that, that we also done with her um and what else is there oh and i'm hoping to get some locks videos on here i've got a friend who her locks are just gorge she got like she colored the front in like they're kind of like purpley pink hot hot um let me say it again her locks are hot so i said to her please you have to let my people know what time it is so i'm hoping that i'll be able to get her to do something about locks a couple of videos i don't know what exactly but i'll keep you posted and Happy 2011, everybody. I still think we made it. And take care of yourself and so on. Um, thank you very much for watching. My name is Chardonnay.